Okay, how do you do fellow YouTubers? Back again with Ezra, and this is my new MOC Future Mac. Future Mac is is a Mac based making Mac made from this set three one zero three four. So I'm using this set to make this that that Mac you see in front of you. Well, that set except from the minifig, it doesn't come from from the set, but the rest of it comes from from the set. This Mac is also inspired by. Mac, Mac made by Wolsey on the Flick Air. He also decided to make Mac from the exact same set I showed you earlier. So if you want to, if you want to see how his his version look, I'm gonna put a link of it in the description below about this creation. You can see his Flick Air chain, Flick Air pits. He made some cool creation there, so I think you really should check check him out. But yeah, enough of that. So yeah, as you can see, this here is. Mac I made. Let me check, let me put the minifig away from now and raise the camera a little bit so that I can show you things are oh, easier. There it is. As you can see, it's a Mac, and I like him. He's a very sturdy Mac that really looking imposing and and sturdy. I mean. He really looks like a Mac that really can withstand any kind of blow and yeah, I really like how, how he looks and of course I, and he's like too and yeah and like like all, all other Mac that I made, this guy can also fit a minifig inside. That's why I put minifig in. So to do that, you need to open this part and open his chest here. And now you can see that he has a crevice here to put a minifig inside. So to do that, you just need to some minifig. Don't I have to ask what minifig is there? It's just like I said, random minifigs that I pulled out. Put it on the sitting position like this, and just put push put in like here. Like uh, the only problem is that the cockpit is a little bit of a tight fit. So yeah, be aware of that if you decided to pull this guy. And light with here, he can sit comfortably like that and put his hand down. Now he has all that, and then you can just close this pin and and then close this. Uh, and there is the minifig goes inside. Well, you can really see it. Yeah, I like how all all the the doors, not doors, flap or something, whatever it is, it completely close up all the, the minifig, so you can see the minifig from from outside. And yeah, I think he looks good and he spread it thick, but yeah. And the back I also like how his backpack here. He has a raster here to make to to give him ability to fly. Well you can literally, you can literally make him fly if you throw him up but yeah. So yeah this backpack really helps him to keep his back from looking like plan and yeah, I like how his detail this this X house looking here and this machine looking and yeah, yeah I really like it and, and his leg as you can see here his upper leg is looking like this this is insp kind of inspired from the Hulkbuster from Marvel I don't remember the number but I think you know the Lego set Hulkbuster smash and yeah and articulation yeah this guy also has plenty he has an ball joint on the shoulder there, so you can turn it around and move it for and back. Ball joint on the this elbow, so you can move it like this on yeah. And also a swivel on the arm, so is that oh well. Yeah, swivel on the arm. And also his finger is all uh okay. This his finger is all articulated. No, not exactly, but they all on the swivel like here, on the hinges, so you can move all of them individually, like that. Yeah. So yeah, you can like put him on a good poses, like for example, like um a metal style like that, or or like shooting and other kind of hand gestures. Oh, and his leg, 
uh, and there's nothing on the waist but i think that's okay then there's is on the waist you can see there's a ratchet here and the ratchet to get in and out and also a ratchet to get front and back and a ball joint here so you can move it like this and then there's also a swivel here and also the toe can be moved here and the head itself well it's clear on ball joint but there's not much clear and i think you can move it a little bit not much but yeah i think he's pretty articulated so i think you get if you want to put him on some good poses you can and uh, let me just yeah i think this is pretty different yeah let me just show you a 360 here front yeah i like how the look of him it looks really like i said a listener really imposing and cool i think side and uh, back yeah like i said this backpack is really helps to to cover the back other side not much to say it's identical symmetrical after all and top yeah now from the top you can see that this guy is pretty thick but this load here really helps to not make him looks like a brick i think and the bottom his scratch it's pretty plain what do you expect a scratch so yeah let me just turn him here so yeah overall so yeah i think overall i think i like him so and yeah so that's all i want to say i guess so thank you for watching and see you next time on the next video.